Hey party people, welcome back to my channel, Sister Moon. I have been like, on my little hiatus and um, I was just telling my Scorpio viewers that I've just been very tired and not sleeping enough and it's hard to pull cards in that situation. But anyways, I'm back and um, I'm gonna do a March reading for you guys. And uh, yeah, I feel like there was something else I was gonna say but I lost my train of thought. So Taurus, I'm doing your reading for March. I have the, um, I keep wanting to say Sister Moon Tarot Deck because it's my channel. And it's like the Moon Child Tarot Deck and Small Spells. Hmm, okay. Let's see what's happening for you guys in the month of March. Or Tauruses. I got an Ace of Pentacles reversed and a Five of Pentacles reversed. So I feel like some of you are having still residual feelings about being left out of a situation, but I don't know. It's like you were hoping to get past this period and you were hoping to start like a new a new stable beginning but that start hasn't happened and you're just kind of like hanging around this feeling of abandonment i feel like there's a three of wands here so i feel like you're gonna have communication with someone that you have been waiting to hear from and i feel like maybe this person let's see what i can pick up here Ten of Wands reverse. I feel like there actually is going to be an ending to a lot of this sad, heavy period that you guys went through. King of Wands reversed. I don't know if you guys are dealing with a Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo, but I feel like if you are, they're kind of in this like extreme. There's a lot of like anger there. Um, maybe a lot of fighting a lot of bickering but there is communication like I don't know if there's that's the person you're waiting to hear from but I'm getting a lot of reverse cards here um, we have the hangman reversed the chariot reversed and the six of pentacles reversed so I feel like you guys are going to make a decision and I do feel like you're going to decide to not move forward with this maybe fire sign or whoever you're dealing with could be a cancer as well because you don't feel like this is a balanced situation one of you is going to decide not to move forward with it it's very imbalanced and very heavy three of pentacles is here some of you might be dealing with a third party situation because i have the three of wands and the three of pentacles and six of wands um i feel like this third party situation this threes a crowd has made you feel very insecure and very untrusting of this person and you're kind of over it with the hangman reverse like I feel like you guys were waiting to see if they would choose you and now you're kind of like well I'm moving on getting rid of this fire sign I wasn't compatible with a fire sign anyway because I'm a Taurus I don't know it depends on the rest of your chart but I feel like you guys are definitely um, not feeling secure and not feeling victorious and you're not feeling like you're getting what you're wanting out of the situation and you're giving, giving, giving and they're not giving back. <sighs> okay, so I got a Four of Swords and an Emperor here. I do feel like now is the time that you're going to take to kind of regroup recover but i do feel like it's not going to be long because there is going to be an emperor coming in i don't know if you guys have a twin flame situation but this could be your twin flame if you're female or this could be you or this could be an aries but it is going to be a strong masculine energy that is present with you I do feel like there's a lot of anxiety that you guys have about what's gonna happen if you let go of the current situation you're in. So I do feel like it's kind of like aching you and like consuming you mentally, but
Yeah, the Empress reverse. So I knew this Empress was going to come up with the Emperor. I do feel like I talked about this with you guys in the last reading. It's so weird. I, did, I just registered. You guys are totally like immersed in a twin flame situation. That's why. So now I'm trying to figure out if the person you're leaving is who you feel like your twin flame is. And maybe you're masculine and you're feeling like they're not getting their shit together. Or you're not at, up to par to be their counterpart. Or the person you're dealing with, you're leaving for your twin flame. But whatever it is, you guys are not quite at the same level here with the Emperor and the Emperor Reverse. So one of you is sort of like not in your element in order to be with the other. So... Wow, I totally forgot that you guys had a twin flame situation last month. Seven of Cups reversed. This was on the top of the deck and then I shuffled and it came out again. So, um, I feel like you guys are trying, like, you're tired of feeling like, just, like, you have to make it, I don't know, like, you're just kind of like, some of you might be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, but also I feel like, you're trying to be very diplomatic about this situation. You're kind of like trying to use your head and not your heart because you feel like your heart has led you astray in the past. So I definitely feel like some of you are being very like kind of dry and detached about making this situation, this decision because it's kind of like with all the cups, all the emotions, you have to kind of rule it out in order to be logical about this. Cause I feel like it's consumed you a lot and like really drained you. Ooh. Okay. So this could be you guys, or this could be another earth sign you're dealing with, but somebody is being resurrected. Something is being revived. Something is coming back to life. Sounds kind of creepy, but like, it's you, I think. This King of Pentacles is you, but it also could be a revival of a, a situation with an earth sign, another earth sign. So let's see what what that's about. What's the king of hell? It's a good card, guys. Ten of cups. Page of wands reversed on the bottom. Uh, ten of cups is a really good sign. So, you guys are going to get what you want. I feel like if you are dealing with a fire sign, they're not. The seven of cups is reversed here again. You guys are trying to, you're, you're tired of all the options and the decisions, whether you think they have a lot of options or you have too many options, but I just feel like you're, you're in decision-making mode. And eight of pentacles is reversed. You feel like they don't want to invest in you. So advice. That card's in here, but it's, there's a lot of cards here. Two of Pentacles, Reverse, Eight of Cups, Three of Swords. So, I do feel like you guys are going to have to walk away, and it might break your heart, but you need to make a decision. That is the message I have for you guys. It's very, very loud and clear. So, it's just going to take a decision-making time. If it's a twin flame, you're not going to lose them. They're always going to be connected to you. So you don't have to worry about that. But you have to make some moves so you could become the empress, if you're the feminine, to be what you need to be for this relationship. So either way, you have to make some sort of decision. All right, guys? Thanks for tuning in, Taurus. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.